Hey YouTube, how's it going? Venomman20 here tonight. I uploaded a video last week about boom slangs. And in the title, I was talking a little bit about boom slang venom. If you actually watched the video, you realized I actually never touched on the venom whatsoever in this video. That was a complete nutter fell on my behalf. So this week, I figured I would talk a little bit about the amazing properties of boom slang venom. Uh, the boom slang venom is mainly hemotoxic venom. This is a rear fang colubrid. Uh, it was originally thought that the moon slings weren't very toxic until 1957 Carl P. Schmidt actually took a bite from a young boom slang and it ended in his death. Uh, at that point I don't believe they were creating anti-venom for even boom slings at all. Uh, at first I don't think he thought it was a lethal dose of venom. Um, he continued working and then he went home and I think it kind of dawned on him that he was going to pass away from this. But at that point he knew there was probably nothing that the medical doctors could do, so he just documented the whole case. It's pretty pretty amazing uh, to hear. Sad, but amazing. Um, but that being said, boom slang venom, when it first bites you, you're probably going to think it's a dry bite. Uh, it, nothing outstanding from the bite whatsoever. Until your tongue starts to swell up. It gets real tender, real puffy, turns very red. That's actually your tongue filling with blood. Next, you're going to start bleeding. You're going to start bleeding from around your cubicles and your nails, out of your eyes, out of your ears, out of your nose. Uh, you're going to be urinating blood. Um, blood is going to be coming out of every orifice of your body, uh, puking up blood. It's massive, massive hemorrhaging of the whole body. And what causes this is when the boom sling first bites you, it starts making your blood coagulate all over your body. And then next, your blood can no longer coagulate because it's used all of its coagulation properties. So therefore, it, it just starts bleeding. You know, you have hemorrhaging all over the body, internal bleeding. Uh, the blood's got to go somewhere. It, it's just a mess. Um, boom slings are one of the most toxic snakes in the world. Uh, they probably are the most toxic snake in Africa. I hate to say the most toxic because, I mean, sometimes black mamba venom works better on a human than, you know, boom slang venom. But then boom slang venom works better on rats than black mamba venom. You know, these are not proven facts. I'm just saying that every venom works differently on every person or every type of animal. Uh, kind of like your uh, Masara is a snake from South America, I do believe. They are actually very toxic to other snakes, but they are not toxic to humans. I mean, we show no signs. So it's pretty incredible how these rear fang colubrids have adapted. Um, you know, there's very few rear fang colubrids that are deadly to people. You have your boom sling, you have your twig snake, but past that, to the best of our knowledge, uh, rufous beak snakes, they are pretty toxic, but uh, still sold as pets, which is kind of alarming, because I do believe they are making anti-venom for them nowadays, so there is a need for the anti-venom, but they're making it in my eyes. Uh, then you have stuff like your boiga, which is like your mangrove snakes. Those are also colubrids, rear fangs. Um, they have venom uh, kind of like a cobra's venom. Uh, a lot of the same neurotoxic properties. Uh, they cause bad necrosis. But anyway, um, with this being said, they're not a deadly snake. They're very beautiful, but not deadly yet that we know of. Uh, but there's just not a lot known about rear fang colubrid bites. So with that being said, I hope you learned something today. I hope all my facts are right. I'm going to check a couple things when I get off here. I don't want to lead you guys wrong. Um, there will be a new video out. I do believe this Sunday I have some stuff going on. I wanted to do a little rant video of some stuff that's really been on my mind. Plus, I have a huge update. This update is amazing. I mean, best news I've ever had to give you guys. So I really hope you tune in for that. Uh, make sure you subscribe so you don't miss that. Show all your friends this video. Uh, go to my Facebook page. There's a link directly down below. So anyway, you have a wonderful night. Thank you for watching.